Hello and welcome. You're watching We On World is One. My name is Haim Korsura and here's a look at all the top stories that we're tracking at this hour. Columbia University cancels in-person classes. Dozens of protesters arrested at Yale and Harvard's gate close to the public as some of the most prestigious U.S. universities scramble to defuse campus tensions over pro-Palestinian protests. Controversial UK government plans for deporting asylum seekers to Rwanda clears the final hurdle after a marathon tussle between the upper and lower chambers of the parliament lasting late into the night. Prosecution in Donald Trump's hush money trial accuses former president of a criminal conspiracy to hide a sex scandal ahead of the 2016 presidential election calls it pure and simple election fraud. Secretary of State Antony Blinken says United States is looking into allegations of human rights abuses by Israel in its operations against Hamas in Gaza. Denied that the United States has double standards when it comes to Israel and human rights. Hezbollah says it has fired dozens of Katyusha rockets at an army headquarter in northern Israel in response to raids targeting villages in southern Lebanon. Pakistan's former Prime Minister Nawaz Sharif leaves for China on a five-day private visit. The PMLN, however, did not disclose Sharif's plans during his five-day stay in China. Over 80 earthquakes, the strongest of 6.3 magnitude struck Taiwan's east coast starting Monday night and into the early hours of Tuesday. Some caused buildings to shake in the capital, Taipei. For latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.